All right, let's warm up. 135. The plates need to be matching. Like we can't use, we can't use that 45 and this 45. Do you agree that you wouldn't use the two different oh, 45s? Oh yeah, 100%. Okay, I feel, I feel like. For some reason, I would feel like one's heavier than the other oh, one. Oh, that one felt heavier. Even yeah. though it's probably not. Oh, okay. I, feel like you, I feel like you'd be judging me by switching the 45s. <laughs> it does in your head. Oh, the worst of the, did you get rid of them? The hexagon plates, oh those, those are the worst. Well, to deadlift with those, that would be terrible. I would be so focused on which part of the hexagon Well, that's what happened. I don't, whoever invented hexagon plates hates working out. That's my, <laughs> that's my. Circle only. No, they, they hate working out. There's no way you would, why would you, like, what's the benefit? Don't judge me, I'm deloading. I was just going to say, so because you're deloading, how many reps are you doing? Um, so probably five reps of like a lot less weight. I'm keeping up with you. I'm keeping down with you. <laughs> That's not nice. <laughs> Why is it so hot in here? Take it off. Oh, I'm like dying. I gotta take the sweatshirt off. <laughs> oh my god, look at his hair. What? Look at this. <laughs> okay, I think we'll be good today. Okay. I'm literally doing 185 for all my sets. Is that too big of a jump for me right now? So I think you did 160 last week and you got 15 reps. 15. So I think you could do 185. Okay. Is We're going right into our sets, right? I'm not going to do another warm up. Yeah, I'm just thinking how many reps you want to do. Because next week I know we I think we're... I'm going to do uh, as never, many reps as I can. You never remind set. me to start this. I'm sorry. <laughs> So you did that 190 yesterday pretty easily. Yeah. You got like two. So I would say, can you do five? Yeah. It just starts as a five. That's not one. It's oh, that is 185. It's 185. Don't you like how the bar stays straight? On yeah. Like, and it's I, just like pretty. I, I bet it's like, yeah. You go first. Uh, like the all black. Oh, you, the new sweatshirt you got me was leaving residue all over me. <laughs> because <laughs> when it's new, it's like the stuff. <laughs> It's okay. Stuck. I like it. It made my shirt better. <laughs> <laughs> you made it better. Looks like you're struggling. <laughs> Don't judge me. I'm deloading. <laughs> I need to wear the shin things. Oh my god. I don't want Are you, to you get okay? The, I don't want you to get the ick. Today's the day you didn't want me to get the ick? Well, if we weren't deloading, I'd be wearing them. So next Tuesday. No straps. You don't need straps. I'm gonna. I felt my woo, Careful. hand slipping. You want to hit your gluteus maximus? <laughs> Let's see. I can go right away, but I don't. I don't want you to rush your rest. Can we go up? Yeah. What do you want to do? Maybe a five on each side. Okay. I'm used to wearing straps. I was about to, I'm like, and I looked at my watch, I'm like, those aren't straps. I burned 19 calories so far. I said, don't judge me, I'm deloading. I can feel the judgment. Don't feel rushed because if I was doing my regular sets, I'd be resting a while. Was that a, not a long rest? So let's talk about rest times. For deadlifts, I end up, I probably, I say three to five minutes, but it probably ends up in reality, reality being like five to eight minutes. Okay. I mean, for something where you're like trying to lift as much as possible, like you want to rest as like as long as possible until you feel fully recovered on the next set. Like if you feel perfectly ready to go, go for it. But like, like a lot of people rush it. Like the goal isn't to rush it. Strap me. That's what she said. I don't know. No, I don't know. <laughs> All right, don't feel. Don't do six again. What? Go for five. 
Five? Yeah, your, your last rep doesn't last time. You have six. Your, rep, your last rep doesn't need to be your last rep doesn't need to be to like failure. I also want to start that new progression with you next week, so like I don't want you to go like all out okay. and fry yourself this week. Good job. Two twenty five? I'll do two twenty five. I mean yeah. Sure. For me, I'm fine with it. So basically I'm deloading. What does that even mean? A deal is basically a period of time where you just take a step back, both physically and mentally. And the goal is just to give yourself like a physical and mental break. So the whole point of taking a deload is do it before you actually feel like you need it because at that point it's probably too late. And the goal is to prevent yourself from burning out so that you make long-term consistent progress, which is hard to do for people. It's hard to take a step back, which Danielle doesn't like doing. Um, so I try to do it like every 10 to 12 weeks and usually I try to plan it like when I'm going away or doing something. Um, I did my last one on my sister's wedding because that week was busy. We're going away in like two and a half months so I'm gonna do it then. So right now is like a good time to like squeeze one in between. Do you wanna do a plate or do you wanna do two? I, I can do either but it's, that's the bigger jump. That's 235, that's 235 instead of 225. Okay. Let's do 225. Wow. Genius. A genius with a penis. <laughs> Why is it so slippery? <laughs> Probably my hands. I think have oil. How many more sets? Two. Oh, we have to reenact our excitement when we saw each other. <laughs> Good morning. It was better than. It was better natural. I didn't even hear what you said. Oh. And then I realized after. <laughs> it, it was better the first time. As you were coming up to me, I'm like... She oh. looked happier to see me before. <laughs> I was confused. I'm also really tired. I'm tired too. It's 5 a.m. by the way. A.m. as in morning. <laughs> what else does A.M. stand for? Well, like... I feel like I might have said 5 and they assumed it was like a late workout. No, you said 5 a.m. I know. So, a.m. as in morning. Not, a.m. is not I know, but, so, but sometimes people hear what they want to hear. So, like, if I spell my last name for people, Go. They, they hear what they want to hear. Don't judge me, I'm deloading. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Wait, babe, are you deloading? I'm, I told you I'm loading. That's why I'm wearing a hat so people don't recognize me. <laughs> Are you Adam Fowl? No, I'm Adam, Adam Pafar. Adam Divine. Actually, I went to, you know, I didn't go to high school, but like people used to ask me if I was related to an Adam Divine. Oh, I was gonna say, isn't that Maroon 5, that's Adam Levine. <laughs> <laughs> Close. Adam Levine. There was a point after I was doing prep that this belt didn't fit me. Okay, hold on. This is gonna be heavy. If you can only get three or so, like that's fine. Don't hurt yourself. Okay. Like it's a big jump. You this take one? those. You take those off off of the reach set. Leave them on. That's the right one. Yeah. I don't know. It's just easier, isn't it? You burn a lot of calories deadlifting. Me? I mean, one burns a lot of calories deadlifting. <laughs> I was like me. You. Maybe we should just do that for cardio. Whew. Don't judge me, I'm deloading. I'm, I'm, I just want you to get this. Motherfucking watch. No issues with that when I'm deloading. She did 160 for 15 last week. <laughs> nice. I'm judging you, you're deloading. The benefit of deloading is no straps. What? No straps when I'm deloading. You don't need it. I'm so happy. Why? Then I just fucking did that. Oh, that was good. I was a little nervous. That was five. All right, so we're gonna be able to reevaluate like your one rep max. Too. No. Okay, so next week is period, pre-period week. We're still gonna reevaluate. Good luck your, for you. We're still gonna reevaluate your one rep max. Well, good luck for my lifts. But well, like, I forgot what. No, I think we were going off like 227 as your one rep max. You just did 225 for five. Four. So you're, that was four five. I think it was five. five. Your one rep max is obviously higher than that, so we'll go off that. Because that's why you got 15 reps last week with 160. Like, you weren't supposed to get that many. Yeah. 
I also feel like since we started deadlifting again, that I'm more comfortable with oh, it. Oh, definitely. How do you breathe? Like, what do you, like, what's your, like... All right, so that's right. So that's what you should do, but basically you grab the bar, take a deep breath, and then lift it. And then exhale, like, at the top. I'm also going slower because I don't want you to rush. Don't worry about me. If you want to hit the long head of your tricep. Okay, so back to breathing. So basically I grip my foot stance about shoulder width. I then grip the bar just outside my foot stance. Squeeze it tight. Take a deep breath. And then exhale at the top. Don't judge me, I'm deloading. Oh my God. I'm judging you that you keep saying it. I want t-shirts that say, don't, don't, don't judge me, I'm deloading. Last one? Yes. So if you notice, we're both doing it like off the floor. We don't bounce it. Uh, that's cheating. The dead in deadlift literally means dead stop off the floor. So that's how you should do them after each rep. Let it come to a complete stop. Don't use momentum. And then do your next set of rep, I mean. My heart rate is at 102 after that set, and I'm deloading. Danielle got me this Apple Watch, which I knew was gonna make me more neurotic. And guess what it did? It's made me more neurotic. I told her to rest longer. These were slipping. Good job. So mad. Don't be mad. Be glad that it happened. Next up, hack squats. Forgot to say it. Don't judge me, I'm deloading. Oh my God. Is it rack? No. Oh. I think I need my belt. Uh, I do wear it on these. It helps. It's just, it's a lot more upright. You feel more like, I feel like you're standing more than the, like the one that we did at Bez is like slanted. Don't judge me, I'm deloading. No, you're not. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's hard to tell, right? You have to do both. It's like so subtle. You okay? It's stuck. What? What am I doing? You're you have to do them on both sides. Yeah, that down on both sides. They're both down? I think so. Why didn't I? Okay. I had the same problem, I know. How many? 10. 10? Is this quad or? I'm going for quad, so. No, 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 am I? I? I know you like to do a mixture. So it's still, it's gonna be quad no matter what you do. It's a half okay, squat. Okay, so what gets both? You're good. I mean, whatever you do, it's gonna. Can I go up I, higher? I'll, I'll, I'll go wherever you're more comfortable. Like, I don't like to like. Is that good? Too I high? Think, I feel like it's a little high. Good? See how it feels. I mean, I, I would do where you feel strongest. You gotta do both. You don't like this one nearly as much no. as the last one. Are you are you second guessing everything now? What? Are you second guessing everything? No. I can get used to it, I'm just not used to it. Yeah. So as far as foot placement, the lower you go, the more quad it's gonna be. As you get your feet lower, it causes your knees to travel more forward. And the more your knees travel forward, the more quad flexion there is. Ideally, if you want more quad, you'd go lower. But it's not like going higher, you're not gonna hit quad. It's just gonna bring like a little more glute into it. But I'm hitting quads, right? Yeah, I mean, I just recommend like most people go where you're comfortable. Like if you're not comfortable up here, don't do it because you're gonna hit like a tiny bit more glute. Like this is, you're not doing this like to hit glutes. If you're trying to hit glutes, we're gonna do other things after that for glutes. Also, the, I feel like the range of motion in this one is smaller. So if I don't go low enough, if I put my feet too high, I hit the bottom. I actually like this. That's what I'm saying. It's not like it's a bad, like I can get used to it. I'm you not still, you. I can get used to it. I don't appreciate that. Hmm? I don't appreciate that. <laughs> I'm like looking around for like alternatives. I'm like, I'm just like waiting for one to appear. And I'm like, but I like this machine. It's more the leg press situation. See my leg shaking? Yeah. She's, she's not deloading. 
So like there's so many platforms here, which is cool, but like look around, like no one's using any of them. They're all on the machines. So you would think they'd be like, oh, we should probably get some more machines. The other location has way more machines. Like they don't have any of those like Techno Gym brand black ones here. Yeah. Like the Garden City one had oh. all those, those like that whole section of like black machines. All right, so breathing on hack squats. So essentially I get my feet set up at the bottom of the platform, roughly shoulder width, mostly quad focused. I unrack it. So right here is a deep breath. Exhale on the way up. Exhale on the way up. I make sure to say it's a deal load like nine like times. Nine? It's a deal load like nine times. <laughs> like 50. It is a deal load, that's why. I will. <laughs> Nothing like the scapula pull scream. No. Don't tell her. What? Don't tell her. I told her about the egg scream, she didn't have a good reaction. So I don't. <laughs> How do my legs look? What do you want them to look like? What are you, honest? They look muscular. They look big. <laughs> Why would I hate that? Because I'm scared that you're gonna be like, my legs look too big. No. But like, you could see muscle? Yeah. Okay. See, he was judging me. I told you. I didn't say it enough. If I said it maybe 10 times. If you say it again, okay. I'm gonna. Okay, no more. Freak out. <laughs> Last one? One more after this. After this. this. Yeah. How does this feel, the weight and everything? Heavy. And like, do you feel like it's hitting you well? Like, do you feel good? I feel it here. Okay, I just wanna make sure like you're feeling it okay. Because like, what'd you do? You, we did like, a, you do like a lot more weight out there on the other one. So, but it's not important. I feel like this feels similar to a plate there. Yes. So, Bev's used to have this one, but not like the newer version, they like the really old one. And it was like brutal, just of the steepness of it. I actually like the, I've always liked this one better. Heart. Feel in your heart. How many calories you burn? 337. You win. I'm gonna be resting like a lot longer on these usually. Yeah, I'm not ready yet. Yeah. This that was your last, right? Yeah. Do you like, wanna go get set up over there? I will. 135 on. You're gonna go higher than that, aren't you? I'm gonna go high reps. Okay. I'll set up I'll set up the barbell. I don't know what to put on like Take the, yourself. I don't know what you, we want to use as like the back. I'm fine with the box. Is that too, isn't it too high? No. I'll try it, I'll see. It's like the same height as a bench. I'll try it. And I won't slide. Drop set. Yeah. Oh yeah, put on the fit girl pad. I'm gonna let you take that down. This looks way too high. You're good. Are you sure? Where do I go? Go under. <laughs> I don't think I can. <laughs> oh, it's my foot. <laughs> now bring yourself up. That's not too and high. Just wrist, just these, up top. Come up. Move your upper back up more. No, go ahead. I think it's too high. Hold on, I'm gonna try to do a rev and see what happens. What? I'm gonna try to do, I'm not like, I'm pushing too. No, lift, move your body up when you come up. But like it, it's not comfortable though. Like, it feels very awkward. I don't think this is gonna work. Am go I, get three I, of these. Am I wrong? What? Am I wrong? Yes. You think you could do it? I don't have time though for it. Can you get look three how, more? Look how high it is. The other way. Nope, nope, nope. No. What do you mean no? Yeah, the other, so this they, way. They were right. See how they're like this? Wasn't that right? No. That's right. Yeah. Those aren't. Isn't that what I did before? No, move it away. You can go first. 
She's getting so mad at me. I know you're getting mad at me, but this is way better. I'm not mad. That was like so high. You're just special sometimes. <laughs> She's mean. This is my third time doing this exercise. So I was doing machine hip thrusts. Danielle convinced me to try barbell. And she was right. They're better. All right, so we got our efficient setup. Three plus the top. What? We got our efficient setup. Three little it's ones. Easy enough one for big you? One. Yes, I like the consistency. Okay. I don't like having to, I know you don't like consistency, but. No, yeah. I would have. I don't like having to I'm find a. easy. I would have loved this the box work, but look, that's triple the height. That's like Mount. That, that's like Mount Everest. This is probably one foot. That's what we used to do. This one doesn't give as much range of motion. What the lower one? This is similar to the box at Bev's. Yeah, that's what I was going for. Don't do these when you have to pee. Do half reps. It's a deload. Just do half I'll reps. Just She's sabotaging the deload. Oh my goodness. Like the top Five half? Them. Like that? Up. Keep your glutes engaged the whole time. Up. 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 Hold. I see Good. what you mean. What? I see what I see. I feel like the end part, really, you really feel it. The end part? No, I, I mean, it's hard to tell because it's light, but. I, I can see what you mean. Those partials. The thing is, that's a short length partial. You want to do a little... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> that was two, so one more. I started? Yeah. So this is my last one? Yeah, you got very angry at me in the beginning. What? You got very angry at me in I the beginning. I did not get angry. I'm just like... Out of my way. <laughs> okay. I'm like, are you kidding? Because I had it the right way. Then you're like, it's the wrong way. I'm like, no, it's not. And then I flipped the other way. It's like... Okay, the, first the, off... The box would have been fine, but okay. I forgot you just started you're, these. You're so like, like you're, you're like with a USB cable where you're like the proper. It's like what? When you put in a USB, it's like it, it doesn't work. You flip it around, doesn't work. You put it back the original way, and it works. <laughs> oh That's God. what you do with me. Are with you the, fucking with the kidding me though? Okay, look how high this is. <laughs> look at this. She wanted to, so we're using this. She wanted to use this. It's literally four times the height. It's not even close. You could have brought your body up for you more body? of like a range of motion, no, but you, you just like a, started this. You're completely so vertical. I forgot for a second. Okay, she forgot that I'm... That I got you into these. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She won't admit that she's... I forgot I got you into butt stuff. Yeah, she got me into butt play. <laughs> So Danielle's a bit of a water snob. <laughs> Essentia. She won't drink anything but. Although I was proud of her when we go out on dates. She I drinks, always drink the toilet water. She drinks the toilet water with me. <laughs> it has sodium too. Yeah, that's, I, we, need, we need more of that in our lives. I am a bit, I wouldn't say I'm a water snob, but I'm not like that. I'm bougie with my I do water. have a filter at home though, so I'm not exactly drinking toilet water on the regular, but I told her that I, if I go on a first date and the girl orders like Perrier and like they won't drink the regular the regular water, I'm like. Apparently these like kill your chances of having babies. I guess because I get sits on your. Really? Is that is that why you're having these? Is that why you're having me do these? <laughs> <laughs> we'll call these vas vasectomy thrusts. <laughs> Love is blind vasectomy or? <laughs> Silly Johnny. <laughs> Silly Johnny. <laughs> it was actually both of them. They, they never like, heard of it. vasectomy, it was just like some sort of simple procedure. <laughs> <laughs> I like how the entire Let's conversation. Let's do it instead of birth control. I like how Fuck it. In the entire conversation, the word condom never comes up. <laughs> <laughs> Probably because they know it's better without. <laughs> So it's a glute bridge if you go halfway. And the one that I was like, go up, like the partials are yeah. KAS glute bridges. It was just a regular glute bridge. Glute bridge is if you move the box out and you go flat. You know how sometimes oh, I'll yeah, sit yeah, the yeah. other ones? So, ca it. so 
path is just basically half range of motion glute bridge. <laughs> I was gonna bend over <laughs> and pick up the bar. <laughs> go, go for it. No, go ahead. I was gonna take this off. What's next? Hamstring curls and calves. Ooh, I know you like to do leg extensions, sorry. I don't do my calves. She made me use this. I love like this muscle right here is my new obsession. I love it too. Why can't you get out of this? I'm trying to do it in a manly way. 